Hi, I'm Dr. C and this is Sorting in Excel using Microsoft Excel Part 2. Here we are back to our Excel spreadsheet and last time we changed the date format, we changed the currency format, and we also expanded the fields and well we I thought we centered these. We'll do it again. There we go. So we've centered our titles. Now what? Well, I want to sort these. And what if I wanted them in date order and then in last name order? I have kept a copy of them over here so we can keep track of the fact that J John Jones was on June 26th and Molly Smith was on March 23rd, right? They all got paid the same amount, so no problem there. We just want to make sure our date and our last names stay together. So we're going to sort first by, let's do date and then last name, okay? So we'll select all our fields, and for convenience, I'm going to get rid of this blank roll so it doesn't mess us up, okay? I'm going to highlight by dropping my cursor on A1, the date, holding down my shift key, and dropping my cursor on D6 to select all of the data I want to sort. So I'm not going to be sorting the right-hand side of the sheet, okay? Now, on the home ribbon, way over on the far upper right, click on sort and filter and we're going to do a custom sort I know that's not where normal people start but hey we want to rock it right <laughs> so we're going to go <clears throat> custom sort and the first category is going to be by last name okay nope date we're going to do date first got to remember that date and it's by values and it's going to be oldest date to newest date okay we're going to add another level because we want to do name also so we're going to click this button called Add Level, and then it says Sort First by Date and then by Last Name, right? Values A to Z. And then always make sure you've checked this little box up here at the top. Now because I clicked it off, it complained, right? But when you check it, you notice what it's doing is it stops highlighting the titles so you're not accidentally sorting them in your data, okay? And we're going to say OK. And there we are. How did we do? Well, let's see. We did have John Jones on June 26th, and he's still June 26th. How about Molly on March 23rd? There she is. So we have sorted our data, and that was a custom sort by two criteria, by date and by last name. I'm Dr. C, and this has been a quick look at sorting in Excel. Have a great day. See you next time.